um, if it's for the first time, hit the subscription button below and may God bless you. Today we are going to study about what are the signs of a high IQ in an individual, both positive and negative. What are the signs of a high IQ in an individual, both positive and negative? Number one, they usually don't fit naturally in most social interactions. They usually don't fit naturally in most social interaction groups, what's, whatsoever. But if you do, they pro purposefully tried at it tried and hard. Yes, they usually don't fit naturally in most social interaction. Number two, they imagine their thoughts always and can consequently often miss many present details. They imagine their thoughts always and consequently often miss many present details. Number three, yes, they are good at explaining things when they are actually trying to simplify. They are good at explaining things when they when they are actually trying to simplify. Number four, they can adopt to anything if they really need. They can adopt to anything if they really need. Number five, stereotypes points that all high IQ people have something pe pe peculiar in behavior. Stereotype points that all high IQ people have something peculiar in behavior. Number six, you notice that the questions they ask are, are questions that make you think, how haven't I thought about that before? You notice that the questions they ask are questions that make you think, how haven't I thought about that before? Please subscribe down below on my channel and may God bless you. We have talked about what are the signs of a high IQ in an individual, both positive and negative. What are the signs of a high IQ in an individual, both positive and negative? Subscribe. Bye.